Hello and welcome back to episode 48 of Control. I'm Vic, and you're watching yet another Let's Play channel, and you did not see what just happened. I know you didn't, because I'm the one that does the editing. So... Looks like... We got one cube over here and two places to put it. And there's something kind of funky going on with the perspective. Alright, you. Um, let's go left. More cubes. Okay. So is that one that I abandoned earlier just like an extra? That's a trap. Up there. Do I take this one back with me? There's a spot right there. Okay, it's gonna keep going. Oh, this one looks different. Uh -huh. Nice timing. This is some very modern looking equipment that we've got set up here. And where's the cube that I'm supposed to toss in there. And why is this a thing? Oh, Jesse, you can't climb that? Okay, well, what do I do then? I used up both of those cubes. There might still be one over there, but I don't think so. I'm getting it over... Oh. Right under my nose. They are literally just the astral analog to power cores. I probably noticed that last time. And I forgot. I feel like when I do a mid-air dash. I should get to keep my momentum. Eat it. Now be my friend. You can be my friend too. time. Hello? Oh. Fine. How about now? Good. Is the astral plane deteriorated? Or were these things just like never connected? Um. Oh. 
Oops. Okay, I guess that's not a problem. Where did it go this time? Come on now. Did it work? Is it in there? I can't tell if it's in there. It doesn't seem to me that something happened. I really like the sense of scale when those things call, fall down. I don't know if I'm supposed to be moving on or not, but the cube didn't come back, so I hope that means it's okay. Okay, so we got what looks like another control point up here. Can I make that? Alright. It didn't feel makeable. Alright. I wish the rock piles didn't go away, but at least they come back. And it's time for a fight. It's almost like he knew. Oh, they're fighting it out over there. If I was not recording this, I would be inclined to just, like, read a web page while I waited for that to sort itself out. Okay, so we got a control point over there that I got to claim. Focus, please. to make him work for me. That's too bad. Nice. Freebies. Excuse me. I don't like it when things are thrown at me. Wow. Pretty good aim. your friend, please. And that's what you get for throwing stuff. 
there was a brief moment just now when I looked at that wall and thought, if I stand next to it and activate it, will it kill me? And the answer, of course, is yes. I don't need to test it. Okay, so we're obviously headed over there. Can I make that? I don't think I can make that, can I? I mean, I guess she just glides when she runs out of float, so... Yeah, with all this altitude, I probably can cover considerable distance. I hope Tyson watches these eventually so that he can enjoy my freefall antics. I know he'll appreciate them. Are you stuck in the wall? Some kind of fool? Really? Well, there was no defense against that. All the way up here? If I just go land on this. I like the marbling in these stones. So what are we going to do about the uh, hiss that's armored in... Astral Walls? Maybe he just won't exist this time. That first one was already activated. Looking sort of symmetrical, huh? Well, not very, I guess. But I did see another trap up there. Several traps. Blow yourself up. Nope, 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 nope. Go play with him. Oh, did he fall? How thoughtful. Um, frequently, they the big guys come back after they fall, though, don't they? Uh, F to put it down? Yes. Nice. And this one, too. Easy. So were these structures built in the astral plane, or does the astral plane have naturally occurring puzzles? Oh, 
Oh, or are these just a consequence of the way these things are bleeding into one another? Probably that one. Although, how are they breeding together? Bleeding together? Uh, to form puzzles. Kind of frustrating the way that I can't just hold that charge when the enemies are just like deciding to not be available for a few seconds. Like that. I don't know if Yuo can see this because I don't know if I'm really here. I see a pen in my hand. I see myself, but it's all wrong. It's the wrong angle, and it's the wrong me, and it's all green. Look out for the color green. Everything turns green when it's close. Don't let it close. Don't let it in. But if and only if you do, no matter what you do not speck to it. Please. I need ya safe, Peggy. I don't want you to end up here, too. I don't know where I've gone. Well, that is a sad little story. And what's this about green? Green isn't a color that I've seen much of around here. No, come on. got another monolith down there. There's some green. I was about to say that it looks like a tarp, but it doesn't look very tarpy in the way that it's damaged there. Hercules and Mabel. I mean, in numbers 3 and 11 attacked my staff today. Two fatalities. Three, if you count Mabel. He's always so kind. As a result, we are abandoning the Foundation. Northmore gave the order to transfer our resources to the upper floors. Now that my control points allow us to safely come and go from the New York streets, did I forget to include that fact in my previous logs? I've been so busy using the arrays I made. Control points have been established throughout the oldest house. Excuse me if I don't sound excited, it's just... A few months ago, I would have been overjoyed to leave the Foundation. But now I realize I've grown fond of it. There's something deep in the stone here, deeper than that watching presence. Something warm. I feel it needing me. 
I won't go. I refuse. Northmore won't be happy, but so be it. I'm starting to see him for what he is. An impotent storm. Father Shade in a cheap suit. Right, so these guys entered the oldest house via the Foundation. Um, and now, apparently, their director wants to abandon the Foundation. You see the rocks off in the distance there? Don't they look kind of like silhouettes of people now? I don't think that means anything, but it's fun. Oh, uh, that's a level 5 mod. I can't just leave it behind. I keep trying to right-click to get out of menus because I've been playing all that Resident Evil. Okay. There we go. And give me that. And what's up here? What is that? It's a VHS tape or something. Very similar. And that's a box that I didn't get. up there so we'll get it and then we'll go down Ooh. Well, those videos have gotten more and more normal as things have progressed, haven't they? Yeah, I'm feeling like we're we're supposed to be very conflicted about uh the board and whether they're on our team. Hey, no. Ugh, crap. Yeah. Okay, so I'm thinking that that wasn't the, a very good way to approach, so let's head over here instead. Yeah, wouldn't it be convenient if when you did a dash in midair while you were levitating that you just kept your momentum? Because physics... It's really hard to put the scientist away and accept that this is a paranormal game. Spawns. Alright, that cleared out some friends. Come play with me. Team now. 
go play with your friends. friends. Seriously. I know I haven't been putting many points in the uh, melee attack, but that was almost a suicide. <laughs> Wasn't what I wanted, but I'll take it. I know I haven't been putting many points in the melee attack, but I feel like even if I had, it wouldn't be doing me much good. Guess if I didn't feel that way, I would have put the points in there. No cool drops? Nothing? There's the etching. All right. Well, good timing, the board. <laughs> Our favorite slash current director. <laughs> I like that. I like that a lot. Um, so do I need to now break it loose? In addition to repairing it? Yes. No. What else do I need to do? That one. And that one. They sure changed their tune all of a sudden. Yeah, it's a little worrisome, isn't it, Jesse? sort out their own business so long as it doesn't get in my way. Obsessing over these problems is something Trench would do. But I've got my intuition. And you. Well, I don't know how you know that Trench would be obsessing over that, Jesse. You think Pope's got anything to say for herself? Oh, look at that. The nail is almost repaired. You really do have a knack for this kind of work. <laughs> Any progress with the nail? Of course. I've been busy with surface analysis. Its composition is remarkably similar to that of material found in the astral plane, but it alters itself between my observations. It's almost as if it doesn't like being examined. So the nail is from the astral plane? Not necessarily. See, if we assume that, we're suddenly facing a lot of new questions. How did something so large get out of the astral plane? How did it get inside the oldest house? Did a threshold bring it in? Did people? Maybe through the motel. Maybe it was always here. Hmm. Doubtful. Okay. Have you spent any time looking into the crystals growing around here? As if I could resist. The biggest question is where it comes from. A threshold? Or is it native to the foundation? But if so, why doesn't it grow in the rest of the oldest house? The fact that they return to an earlier state when damaged is severely inconsistent with our reality's adherence to linear time. So either they're A, partially conscious, or B, organic elements that are foreign to and yet influenced by our dimension. The jury's still out. Have you learned anything about the crystals? I have a power that lets me stretch them. Huh. Yep. <laughs> 
I like these conversations. Any idea what Marshall would be doing down here? That information is on a need-to-know basis, Faden. <laughs> Sorry, I can resist. But honestly, I never had much interaction with Marshall. She only came to me when she was looking for Darling. But this is Helen Marshall we're talking about, the woman who single-handedly dealt with the Bergen Peak AWE. If she's down here, it's because she needs to be. Well, clearly she couldn't handle this one on her own. I'll see you later, Emily. Good luck. Take notes. <laughs> All right, and with that, we're out of time for episode 48 of Control. So come back and see me again next time for the last thingy. And maybe some other stuff. What do you make of the art on the walls down here? I'm trying to work out Talk to you soon. Origins.